Good afternoon, friends. My name is Andrei Lobov. I represent the company Steen. I want to share the latest news with you, and I think that this news is very interesting. We have developed a lightened kit that allows to install this great motor, DA90SM. It already has the cooling system. It allows to install this motor on any light equipment, on tricycles, on motorbikes, on self-propelled trucks. What is included in this kit? This great motor, of course, DA90SM. On the motor we install, and you can see now, we fix a ventilator, 800 watt, for cooling. If we send this kit to hot countries, then we always install a ventilator, just in case, to avoid overheating. It also includes cabling. What have we done with cabling? All equipment is very different. We can never guess the length of cables. That is why we install such connectors. They are moisture resistant. They are automobile connectors. All the kit has such connectors. And that is why you have the possibility to lengthen the cabling. The kit is running, the motor is rotating, but you still can lengthen the cabling to the required length. This kit also includes a DC-DC converter of the needed capacity that clients order from us. It also includes a controller that controls the motor, a throttle and switches, forward, backward and on-off. I will show all of that to you, for sure. And the main thing, who ordered this kit? Our partners from Sri Lanka ordered the kit. You know, they have the following situation on Sri Lanka now. Ecology, it is a big question. There is a lot of smoke from equipment, from gas, from internal combustion engines. Besides, they lack combustibles, they lack fuel, which is used in internal combustion engines. It becomes very expensive. What interesting things have happened in the last year? When we prepared a kit for India for Bajaj Maxima, we saw that the motor allowed to develop a speed up to 20 km per hour just using solar panels with a capacity of 600 watt. And this kit, if you put solar panels on it, allows not to use the plug at all and rather to be charged from the sun. Even our Moscow region sun, you know, I have never used a plug. The battery was always full. I covered 50-75 kilometers per day. The battery was always charging. And it was enough for me for the whole day to carry out the tests and to cover the distances I needed on the tricycle. Yesterday we packed the kit, we put it in a very solid wooden box and we gave it to our partner Rupasira, who sent it by the Russian post to his motherland. Good afternoon. It is the 2nd of March today. It is spring. It is sunny. Despite the sad events which are happening now, we want to send our kit to Sri Lanka. You know, in our country there are many tuk-tuks that run on fuel. They run on diesel as well, and we want them to convert to electricity. That will help, first of all, the atmosphere, the environment, the ecology, and that will also help boost the economy. It will help in different areas of economy, and that is why today we are making the first step. We are sending the soul of this kit, the motor, the engine. And then we will send the remaining details, components. Today we are at the post office. We have just given our kit for it to be sent. 
We are going first of all, of course, using solar panels. So we are going to check whether we can use solar energy and run on it. I am 80% sure that we will succeed in that. So it will be an ecologically clean type of transport. And we will start with three-wheel transport and then we will be able to use it on electric bicycles, electric motorbikes and also Sri Lanka is surrounded by the ocean and we have boats and gradually, step by step, we want to switch to our motors completely. Thus, we start our project and first of all we want to help the country. We want to help the environment. And thus, we are sure that we will get economic profit from it. And our project will really help a lot in all areas to boost the economy. And of course, it will help us develop friendship between Russia and Sri Lanka.